Hello and welcome to Asus UK. Often in these videos we've been pretty focused on gaming stuff, covering components, peripherals, gaming notebooks, all that sort of thing. But this time we've got something a little bit different in the form of this, the Asus Vivo Watch. So this is a health wearable designed for monitoring fitness, steps, heart rate, calories burned, sleep, etc, etc, and tracking them all via an app. You can also see your notifications, so there's some smartwatch functionality in there as well. We'll talk a little bit more in depth about the kind of features that this thing has a little bit later in the video. But for now, let's see what you get in the box. Okay, so here is our Vivo Watch box. We've got a little picture of the Vivo Watch on the front there. We'll just slide this off to get to the box itself. It's all matte laminate, so it feels very nice. It's also a little bit snug. Let me just take this off. And the first thing you'll see, of course, is the watch itself. You'll notice that it's already powered on. I did have a little bit of a play with it earlier, so it is already on and working. And underneath here is pretty much everything else that you could need. So we've got our warranty info here, instruction manual, and we have our USB charging cable. This is just a standard micro USB charging cable, so you don't have to worry too much about bringing the right cables around with you because you probably have one of these in your home already, since so many different devices use them these days. And we also have the final part here, which is in its own teeny tiny little case here, is the charging dock. So this connects to the watch itself via those pins there. You just clip the back of the watch on, and then you can charge it via the micro USB little slot there. And that's pretty much all there is to it. It takes a couple of hours to charge and the battery lasts up to 10 days. Since this is designed to be worn all the time, it's good that you don't need to charge it up every day. You can even go on holiday for a week and you don't have to worry about keeping it juiced up. It's IP67 rated too, so you can leave it on in the shower or take it for a quick dip in the pool without any issues. So as I mentioned before, there are quite a few things which the Asus Vivo Watch is capable of tracking. Using the Hi Vivo app, or Apple HealthKit or Google Fit, depending on your preference or which device you own, you can track your calories burned, your heart rate, and your steps. If you hit this button on the side of the watch here for a couple of seconds, it'll also put the watch into exercise mode, which increases the sensitivity and the accuracy of the heart rate monitor. It'll also track your sleep to give you an insight into your sleep quality by measuring heart rate, any movement you might make, as well as the total duration of your sleep. All of these factors will combine to give you a single score out of 100, which is the happiness index. So this gives you a very easy number to look at to see your overall health and well-being as measured by the watch. The general targets set by the Asus Vivo watch are calculated automatically based on height, weight and gender, but you can change these yourself if you'd like to. There are a couple of other features which you can change depending on your preference. So there's a couple of different watch faces on here, so you can pick between a couple of different analog and digital faces depending on your preference. You can also manage your notifications and which things are sent from your phone to the watch. So you can either have absolutely every notification go to the watch or just pick out a few things that you think are most important. You can also set various alarms, which will make the Vivo watch gently vibrate in case you need to be woken up at a particular time. So in short, the Asus Vivo watch actually gives you quite a lot of functionality in one device. You've got fitness and sleep tracking, watch, alarm, notification sync, all wrapped up in that waterproof shell and it can last for up to 10 days without needing to be powered. There's been quite a few software updates already to add extra functionality and there will be more in the future so do expect extra features and more watch faces coming in the future. The Asus Vivo watch is available now, I will put a link in the description somewhere either above or below this video depending on how you're watching this. I'll put a link in the description somewhere so you guys can have a look at a little bit more info if you'd like to. As always thank you so much for watching this video, we do appreciate it very much. If you liked it be sure to leave us a thumbs up and yeah we will catch you for the next one so thanks very much for watching and see you later.